We learned door tech. Yeah, you know what? I didn't... What I gained is invaluable. You cannot put a price on knowledge. And what I gained was some very, very important knowledge about the doors in this video game. Okay, we need to go to the records room. That's where you get the jack. And then we're pretty much done, except for the top floor, which is pretty simple, so. I hear our friend X. This is, uh... No, it's not this room. Why are you so slow, Leon? I was gonna say, are you coming? I can't tell where anyone is, or rather where he is, because the... Sounds don't quite match up! Oh my god! <sighs> Freaking zombies in this place. Okay. Why are there three? Oh, cause that one was in the uh, in the library. Okay, so where are we? Where are we going? Where are we going? We're going into the records room. We should go there straight from reception. Okay. Hopefully this doesn't come back and bite me in the ass. I have a heal. I don't want to use it, but I know that this hallway is going to be ass, isn't it? There's a liquor on the ceiling. Ah, there's multiple liquors. So you know what? Run! What the heck? Hopefully we can make it through the door. <laughs> Get through the door! Leon! Oh god. Okay, where are we? Where are we? Where are we? This is gonna suck. Excuse me, zombie! Well, there's uh, another grenade out. Where's the freaking gunpowder in this room? It's right by the door, right? There it is. Okay. Did I get it? I got it. I don't think we can get out through this door because it is the heart door. This hallway sucks. I think we do go north because of the liquors to the south. So go! No, that was a bad idea. Maybe it was a great idea. I don't know. Just go. This is the only time we ever have to do this hallway. Leon, heal. Leon, heal. Good heal, good heal. No, Leon! 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 Oof. I'm out of grenades, that's why this doesn't work. Leah, oh my god. <laughs> Come on, Leon. Come on, fight for it, Leon. Fight for your right to live, Leon. Get through the door, Leon. Go, Leon, go. That's another liquor. There's... Leon! Good Christ! How many enemies respawn in this area? Good Lord! 
Ah. <sighs> All right, plan B. We're going to kill the two liquors here, and then we're just going to backtrack here. No reason to worry about safety deposit room hallway. Yeah, that was a very cursed five minutes for Leon. He woke, I imagine him waking up at this desk going like, oh, oh God. Oh, oh, oh. Looks like those windows could use some boards. Yeah, you know what would be really nice is, uh, if I had more than two, that'd be really nice. Okay. You know, actually, there we go. Let's bring some firepower along. I was wondering why I couldn't swap to the freaking grenade in the hallway. All right, so new, new plan. Don't have Mr. X on your ass. That way, you can more easily do the hallway slower and more methodically. Also, why did that liquor on the ceiling when I first walked down the hallway, how did he know I was there? I was walking. So maybe, uh, maybe I don't fully know the mechanic for the avoiding the liquors. Because I thought we would have done it, but I guess not. Okay, you know what, if they're both there... That's what I think about that. Sounds good to me. Okay. Much better. <laughs> His tongue was hanging and you hit it. Ah, okay. So the liquor, the liquor, the first time I walked down the hallway, I was walking, but he tongued me. I guess they are called liquors and not blinders, you know? Something tells me he knows where I am. That went very well, though. That was basically perfect. And we don't need to go north, and we don't need to go to the safety deposit room right now. I know that there's liquors here, but we can run from the west office into the safety deposit room to do the terminals once we have both of the key codes. Okay, he does know where I am. Also, how does he know where I am? I was being a silent, stealthy boy. Totally, totally. You've been annoying me. Uh, so we need to go to the library and do some jacking. I feel like I want to clear out some of these enemies too. But let's go to the library and start the jacking process. I 
Okay. Just a muffled grenade and nerfed shotgun sounds. I mean, how far does the sound really travel in this old jank building? I'm sorry, X. I was doing some redecorating. With my skull. I am actually fine after that. That's what surprises me the most. They're still up. I expected you to still be up. I don't even know if I killed him. I sh I should have dealt with them earlier. They're just in the way. No. Please go faster. <laughs> I need you to open the door, my friend. No! Oh my god, he's so much faster than you expect. Leon. Alright, do I have any heals on me? Leon! Get up the ladder, Leon! I can take another punch, I think. He can climb ladders! He evolved! Leon is such a slow ass. All right, I feel like I need to go to a safe room at this point. Buy myself some time. Okay. I think there's a liquor in there, so let's definitely not go there. Where are all these enemies coming from all of a sudden? No, get off it, Leon! Bud says, it's funny how you can spend as much time as you want on a key or putting up boards, but moving a bookshelf is live action. Yeah, and then you get punched in the back of the head by Mr. X. All as it is meant to be. But yeah, that is weird, like... I guess they just want you to do it live. Also... I need to move that one over one, and then we're done. But I'm still going to... I'm still going to, I think, try to go to a safe room and get Mr. X off of me, because I know the upstairs has a, a multiple zombies. You can move two at a time. Oh, really? That's actually very good to know. I did not know that. I thought you could only do one at a time. Because why would you be able to do two? That doesn't really make that much sense. But, that's useful to know. Alright. So now that's done. Uh, actually, really quickly before... We're done done. Let me grab the ammo that I know is back here. Now we can go. All right, hopefully everyone down here is dead. I don't want to have to deal with you. I hope you're dead. Oh no, this room is full of liquors. I don't want to go this way. I want to go up. Well, I guess we're going up. As soon as we hit a safe room... Oh, you can move all of those shelves at once. As soon as we hit a safe room... 
This will all this will get a lot easier all of a sudden. Oh, but you know what? If there's a liquor in that west storage room, that's my primary route over, unless we go through the lounge. Maybe we can walk this way. Oh, it's the linen room. I need to go here anyways. Perfect. Perfect. I hope he is not on my ass though. Okay, it's the other portable safe. Yeah, I don't hear him. I think he's at the end of the hall. Yeah, the, the Mr. X music has stopped. We're safe. For now. I wish this was like Five Nights at Freddy's and I could watch him on the camera system and have like a hey on the other side of the area. <laughs> We want to go to the stairs and then down to the dark. Well, he's off of me now, so now I could go back to the library. So it would be... Because I think there's a liquor in here. But if we go down there, we can save and we can actually do the whole entirety of the safety deposit room. Are you kidding me? That's fine. We'll just go to the stairs as I was suggesting. Are you sure he's off of you? He's hoping. I think this is a safe room. I noticed that last time I was playing that he never went in here. So I'm pretty certain we're safe now. Saw him in the corner of my eye when you paused. Oh, I didn't see him at all. I was just looking at the map. Next, gonna give it to me. We need more ammo, too. In the end, I ended up killing a lot of the zombies, so... We should have just killed... We should have killed a lot of them earlier. But also, where's the freaking knives? I need more knives to more efficiently kill them. Okay. Dark room, liquor hallway. I wonder if the Magnum can one-shot him in the head. It seemed like the shotgun when I had used it was not very effective. If I get lucky, maybe I can just walk past him. I hope there's none in this room. Kind of sounded like there was. Let's get the roll film. It looks like the game also really wants me to make normal ammo. I've been neglecting that. But at this point, the game is like, make normal ammo. You have so much gunpowder. And maybe we should do that. Maybe we should do that and then use Matilda with the tap, tap, tap. I mean, I do have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven normal gunpowder. Well, let's make some. Do, do, do. Yeah, like health? Other than the very, very beginning, health has not been too much of a problem. Okay, take the key out. 
do this. You can do the locker room keypad and get out that out the way. Locker room keypad. Locker room keypad. What the hell is lock? I don't know what locker room keypad is. Excuse me. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. Get out that, you can get out through, you can get out through this room? Is there like a secret wall or something? You can get out through the safety deposit room? I know there's a door there, is there a second exit? When you pass the whiteboard it said cap, that's the code for the locker room. Oh, I've, I've already done all the lockers. I've done the locker here, I've done the locker on the third floor. Yeah, the lockers are already done. The only thing I have to do in this hallway is the, the key terminal. For the locked doors. For the, well, the locked lockers. Otherwise, they wouldn't be locked lockers. So I'm tempted to just shoot him in the head. But also, I know that there's two here. Sees me. He knows I'm here. Oh, Jesus. Uh, I'm effing around. I'm not, I'm just trying to get to a damn door. You keep, man, it is so hard to like get away from enemies quickly. Like you just can't, you are so slow. <laughs> also one, sh one headshot from this was not enough. Also disappointing. But at least we can get through. We've got some key codes to open. I think 203 is more capacity. Yeah, so we get another inventory upgrade. We can do 102. 103 should be a knife. I haven't had a knife in such a long time. <laughs> William Birkin stole one of my knives, by the way. It's not just me. It's often me, but not just me. Nope, 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 back, 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 back. Two oh, oh my god, two oh seven. Two oh eight. I don't think there was anything in two oh nine, but I'll just do it here so I don't have to bay a track with there being a zombie at the end of this hallway. Oh my god, I've got a knife again. It's a miracle. So we're done with this side. 
Now we need to go up to the clock tower. God, which is in the, in the library. Okay, back to the library. Running a little low on ammo, but we can always, I can always make so much. Let's see. I can make so much pistol ammo if we need it. Man, I, I, I've got to admit, I still don't have a good strategy in this game for dealing with liquors. When, when you have to kill one that's in your way, I really don't. It's so easy with Claire because one grenade launch around will just stagger them. They'll flip upside down and go, Meh! A grenade works too, but uh, even the magnum to the head didn't even, didn't stun him at all. Who else is waiting for Armored Core 6 as Academy Kill? I know my friend, uh, and Chris is. Grenaded shotgun. You would think that a magnum would work, though. Let's don't run. Don't run. Just walk. That first floor left side of the area got real disgusting real fast. <laughs> With all of the liquors that have appeared. That is a nasty area now. <laughs> Chris is not waiting. We'll play it as soon as it comes out. Unless it's already out. Okay. And there's a liquor in that room, too, all of a sudden. Now, I remember there's two enemies at the end of this hall. On the right. Mr. X on the bottom floor, I think. I'm gonna... Probably have to kill these ones because there's one right here around the corner. And I'm t I think I'm just gonna wipe this one too because I need to be able to run down this hallway. I don't think that one's dead though, but that's okay. PS5 is still two hours away since Academy Kill. You gotta wait for it to come out on PS5 at a different time from other consoles or releases? That's interesting. I still have one board, too. One safety plank. You dead? He's dead. Okay. Well, we know how to do this puzzle. Clunk! Yes, I know. Pair plan for the elevator. Surely, like, you could also just get a stick and then poke the box. I mean, there's literally a like a pole right there. You could just, you know, Leon, <laughs> you could just grab that. Need the small one, which I think is upstairs. And I don't remember what's down here. Apparently nothing. Oh no, large gunpowder. Again, I think if I'm not mistaken, I think you get more bullets for your bang by making two larges together because that should give you four times the normal amount that you would get instead of two times by using one regular and one large. So I will I will wait for another large to make its way into my inventory before I craft with that. You could also just use it to make like 
shotgun rounds or something, but. p.m. What time is it right now? I guess it's almost 10 p.m. for me. Hope I don't have to write a report on this. Oh, Leon. You're so funny, Leon. Custom part for a power panel. Okay, so we are... We're good to go. I think we're done. Oh no, there's one one storage room, or one room in the east storage room to do, and then we're done. We don't have the heart door. That's what Claire had, I guess, so... Can't go there. Yeah, we are... We're out of here. Ada, here I come. Where's X? I think X is downstairs. Go, 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 go. I hear him on the other side of the, the balcony, I think. So what was uh, what was in this room? I never actually went in here, looks like. Oh, I can't. All right, that's fine. That is totally fine. As long as no liquor spawn here, we're, it's totally fine. So we need to take the stairs down. One level. Go down the fire escape. X gonna give it to me unless I run away. Run. Wow, I've gone through a lot of shotgun rounds. Ammo's starting to dry up a little bit. Just a wee bit. That's fine. I, I don't think I ever have to come down this hallway again. Now, if I had known that you would jump out of that window, I would have boarded it up, but that's fine. So we'll put away this and this and this and this, and we'll get the electronic part back. And honestly, I think I'm just going to make a lot of ammo because I have so much gunpowder that I can't use. I don't have the large, sorry, not the large, but the, like the enhanced nonsense. So I'm just going to, just going to make nine millimeter rounds, I guess. Make some more. It is kind of like having a, uh, it's not, not a good SMG, but it's kind of like having an SMG by having Matilda, since you can, you can go boom, boom, boom. And have a little triple shot kind of happening. So we'll hold on to the ammo and that ammo and that ammo. So we have two different types of pistols, a little, a little annoying, but sure. Why not? Maybe we actually put away the shotgun. It's so small, like we can, we can hold it. We can put away the grenade since we have the knife. We have the power, power parts. I have healing, I have a couple of grenades. I think we're good. Okay. 
can hold 24 rounds too. That's pretty good. See you. Okay. And I've got the knife. And I no more dogs. Hopefully no more dogs. So we need to go back to the jail. Kind of worked as intended. That's a lot of dogs. That's way too many dogs. <laughs> I think I hear another one. I hope not, but that is also a lot of dogs. But better, better using you know this ammo than the, uh, the shotgun ammo. Shotgun is for when I need someone's head to disappear immediately. And my plan for all of these enemies here is throw a grenade as soon as the door is open. And then just run! So we have, it's not a purple wire this time, it's a yellow wire. I assume it's the same, same puzzle though. Although I don't know what the hell this thing's all about. Go this way, a loop around, T-junction. So that's gonna be like this, that's gonna be like this, and this is gonna be like this. I guess it's gotta go through that one in order to, to make it yellow. Flashbang would be better than a, than a grenade. Well, I've got one and not the other, so it is what it is. Ben's memo. The station's swarming with monsters. Even here I can hear their cries. But it's not the zombies I'm afraid of. Codename Tyrant. The ultimate bioweapon developed by those bastards in the utmost secrecy to think that this thing might be wandering around here. Chances are they've ordered it to wipe out the witnesses. they possibly be at Leon 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 <sighs> what could they possibly be after Ooh, okay oh this did not go down the way I thought it would go down oh I see what's going on Give me a break Don't get smashed in the back of the head, Leon. Leon! There's no items here, so just go. And there could be paper, I suppose. Oh, we could have we could have snuck by. Just... We could have snuck by uh in one of those cells. Ada, 
This is getting old. Saving your ass, that's twice. I didn't realize you were keeping score. Look, this isn't a game. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Nothing dies down here. I take it you have the key card. Yeah, and this. I was hoping you could explain what's on it. Maybe. After I hear it. Let's get out of here. How annoying must it be to always be prepared for anything? <laughs> She, she has to have so much, I'll get to it. She has to have so much C4 on her at all times to be able to put it everywhere. Ride a bus to work, have C4 to put under the seat. Steal a SWAT car to ram Mr. X, put C4 under the seat. Open the damn shutter already. Leaning up against some shutters, have some C4 under the seat. Must be real tiring. Yeah, in heels, too. <laughs> At least she's got the trench coat. We are done. We are done. Ah, she's listening to it right now. Nothing here. Perfect. They wouldn't even let me throw a grenade at her. Unfortunately, no. Ben didn't come through. Well, what exactly are you looking for? More info on the people responsible for this mess. What about you? Trying to save the world? Yeah, well, someone's got to get word to the authorities. We need reinforcements to save this city. I think the city is a lost cause at this point. She's probably thinking, Leon, why are you holding your gun like that? You look like an idiot. Roads out. Going through that gun shop looks like the only way. <gasps> gun shop, you say? Gun shop kendo. Good old FBI work, huh? What a mess. This, that reminds me, that, this reminds me of a scene from X-Files at some point. I, I forget what exactly happens, but someone's lockpicking a door and someone's like, ah, this is what the FBI does with their time, huh? Thank you. Long barrel? Too many long jokes. A custom part for the shotgun that ups its max capacity to eight, greater velocity and less spread makes each shot more powerful. Finally. Better shotgun. Dude, that's, that's pretty handy. I'll take it. Not a lot of room for anything else in his limited inventory, but better shotgun. Sounds good to me. That was, like, two bullets. <laughs> Letter to the shopkeep. Kendo, it seems like you've got your reasons for staying put, so I'll trust you to take care of yourself. Still, if things get worse and your other arrangements don't work out, you know where to find me. I'll do everything I can. Jill Valentine! You're a Resident Evil person. Jill Sandwich. Don't move. I'm not gonna hurt you. I said... Don't move. I'm just passing through. I'm gonna ask you to lower that weapon. I kill you are. You gotta turn around and go right back out the way you came in. I think your daughter needs help, sir. Don't tell me how to deal with my daughter. Drop it. 
No! Wait! Step aside. We need to terminate her before she turns. Terminate? It's my fucking daughter. Ada. Just let them be. Emma? Sweetheart, I told you to stay put. Daddy. Yeah, Daddy's here. Come here. Okay. Those fucking things outside. Look what they did to us. You're a cop. You're supposed to know something. How did this happen? Huh? She was our sweet little angel. Mommy. I'm asleep, babe, honey. Okay. And I'm gonna put you to bed, too, okay? Emma. Our privacy. You know, it's one thing to keep the truth from me, but why him? I want to find out what's happening here and stop whoever's behind it. Helping people like them? That's why I joined the force. My mission is to take down Umbrella's entire operation. We may not make it out. Whatever it takes to save this city, count me in. Hmm. Well, that's just exceptionally sad. Also, I'm I might be beginning to think that maybe heard of the Umbrella Corporation? They're a pharmaceutical company secretly making bioweapons. They have a virus. It turns people into indestructible monsters. That explains the horrible things I've seen. That explains all of the monsters. I'm beginning to think maybe in this remake of Resident Evil 2 Ada is actually trying to stop what's I'm happening, but who Matt knows? Birkin. She's the one at Umbrella responsible for unleashing the virus. I'm going to bring her down. That's the reason I became a cop. That explains these horrible monsters. They're pretty monstrous, aren't they? This is how we get to that. The sewers. Based on what you've said, the sewer seems fitting. Well said. After you. Gee, thanks. Gee, thanks. <laughs> All very video gamey. Well, it is a video game, Harrison. So that would make sense. Can't imagine a real scientist being down here. According to HQ, this leads right into Umbrella's secret facility. Come on. Sewers are run by the city. How could they have a facility without the authorities knowing? Welcome to corporate America. Umbrella's controlled Raccoon City for years. Problem. 
Oh. <laughs> oh, now she's running back. Leon! I'm coming, Leon! Leon! Oh. Okay, well, there is stuff here. And now she's pushing up against me. Ooh, Jesus. God. That an earthquake? I sure as hell hope so. Oh, that's it. Just some ammo. Probably something. something blowing up. What the hell? Stay shot. God only knows what's down here. What the hell? That one's someone's pet. That is uh, someone's pet that they flush down. And it's a save point. Beautiful. And it's a box as well. Perfect. Although I don't really have much to deposit, and the only thing I have in my inventory that I don't have the ability to even use is just gunpowder, but that's okay. Resident Evil is a fun game. I've been enjoying my time with it. And I, I kind of do want to play through... Hello? I kind of want to... I kind of want to do playthrough. <laughs> I kind of want to also play uh, the other Resident Evils, but... I don't know if the the older ones are are worth jumping into, but... We could very well try it out at some point. If I was going to replay this... I would probably replay it on on hard mode. Now that I uh, I understand more about the game, but also more about like where everything is with uh, with Leon's B campaign. And I understand some more of the mechanics, like you can't open a door when it's behind you. October would be a good time to binge Resident Evil. You know what's the second best time to binge Resident Evil? Now. I won't, I won't be binging it, but I'll definitely be, uh, well, almost certainly be playing more of it. Again, I, I bought the uh, the Resident Evil pack, so I have pretty much all of the Resident Evil games now. And I've never played them. I've never played them before except for like some of four a long time ago that I don't really remember too much. So we have the capability to play more and to have a good time doing it as well.